word, look at that. <laughs> Happy days. <laughs> <laughs> this is orgasmic. Hi, I'm Ben. I'm Josh. And we're from Nordic Food Lab. As far as I know, there's no one who's working on insects from a gastronomic point of view in as much depth as we're trying to do here. It's delicious. Why don't Westerners eat these things? These are royal caviar. I feel like the bee man, except not at one with the colony. <laughs> Is that it? Oh no. We've squashed the queen. One of the most delicious luxuries that this country has to offer. Not all what the Westerners do is correct. Hey, our food was better. It didn't have all the chemicals. We did a literal circumnavigation of the planet and I got food poisoning once from a burger in Sydney. That burger probably contained, it was traces of like 500 different cows. How much are you shifting? Several tons a week. A few tons a week sounds like a lot. You could very easily design a system which was completely unsustainable with a very sustainable insect. It's like a real deal conference. It freaks me out. Yeah, it smells. Yeah. Yeah, it smells. I money. <laughs> Sorry? You smell money. <laughs> These lights burn the shit out of your eyes. It's not like we should just blindly advocate the eating of these things because they've got great proteins in them and everybody's hungry. Who's going blind as a result? Diamonds are pretty, but they often come from slavery.